Hey everyone, Theo here from Movement Theory. This is part two of my hip mobility series. The release technique that I'd like to present to you today is for the piriformis muscle. This muscle is located underneath the gluteus maximus muscle. It originates at the sacrum and attaches at the femur. Its responsibilities are external hip rotation. If you're someone whose feet point outward while you stand, it's likely that your piriformis is tight. Tension within the piriformis muscle can lead to low back pain and hip pain. To release your piriformis muscle, we're going to be using a medicine ball. The medicine ball should be dense enough so it does not give as you sit on it. Begin in a seated position so the ball is at the midpoint on one side of your glute. Drop your hand to the ground and cross your ankle to the opposite knee. This is going to expose that piriformis muscle. To force your hip into external rotation, grab the shin of that leg and bring it closer to your body. Now once you find an area of sensitivity, hold and leave it there. Hold on a trigger point for 30 seconds to a couple of minutes depending on the level of dysfunction. When the pain subsides, find another sensitive spot and hold and leave it there. You can roll as close to the tailbone and as far away to the head of the femur to hit those trigger points. Be sure not to apply too much pressure to the hand that's on the ground. This is just a support system as you balance your body weight onto the ball. Check out part one of my hip mobility series where I cover a gluteus medius and minimus release. Those releases along with this one will help align those hips. Thanks for watching. Please stay tuned for part three of my hip mobility series. Like this video, share it with your friends, and subscribe to my YouTube channel.